Hello and welcome. I'm Dr. Sunanda Roy. In today's video, we will learn about dyslexia by getting to know Ishan. He may remind you of a character with the same name in the famous Hindi movie Tare Zameen Par. So let's get to know more about Ishan. Adults and even children like Ishan face challenges in learning which is known as learning disability or learning difficulty. Ishan has adequate mental abilities and also shows high abilities in drawing, sports and other extracurricular activities of his interest. All his sensory processes related to his five sense organs like eyes, ears, skin, tongue and nose function normally. He is also motivated to learn so the teachers need to identify the best way to teach him. So, what are the difficulties in learning? There is a deficit or a problem in perceptual processing, which means he makes errors while giving meaning to information obtained from his senses. This is especially seen while identifying letters or numbers. Integrative processing of information which is organizing words or numbers is also affected which results in him finding it very difficult to express himself. All these result in children like Ishan having what is known as learning difficulty or learning disabilities. The causes of learning difficulty is not very clear, but there are indications from brain imagery studies that it is caused due to some neurological dysfunction. Children like Ishan find it difficult to identify letters or even numbers as the brain sends many messages causing a type of traffic jam while identifying the letters or numbers. Unlike neurotypical children who while reading the letter B will be informed by their brain that this is the letter B and not D or P or so on. Inadequate instructions can also lead to learning difficulties. If the teacher goes too fast or is not clear about the instructions, then there are doubts that remain unsolved in children like Ishan. This results in poor foundation, so they may be promoted to higher classes without having a strong foundation to learn new things. Some studies sh also show that um, poor environmental conditions like poor diet, exposure to pollution may contribute to learning difficulties. There are different types of learning difficulties based on the challenges that children face while learning and the degree to which their learning is affected. Dyslexia is a type of learning difficulty. It is a language-based learning disability or difficulty. Ishan will help us understand what he experiences as he exhibits dyslexia. How does one really identify dyslexia? Ishan says that he finds it difficult to organize his written and oral language. So reading becomes very challenging as it is difficult to organize the letters into words. This results in words or lines being missed out while reading. Another effect that Ishan tends to do is that he shortens words, that he is unable to identify whatever words or letters that are there. There is a confusion with letters in the brain, as the brain sends different messages while identifying or perceiving letters and so, as mentioned earlier, he may read D as B or P as Q and so on. There are errors that are made in spellings. As Ishan finds it very difficult to read words like felt, he may consider it as left and make errors while copying all these things down in their notebook. Children like Ishan find it very difficult to understand rhyming words. So, 
errors in spellings, rhyming words and even pronunciation difficulties arise from the problems of identifying and perceiving letters and words. Dyslexia, though is lifelong, can be reduced provided it is detected early. The good news is for the teachers that there are many teaching strategies that can be used to help students like Ishan overcome dyslexia to quite some degree. The mastery model can be used where students need to master a small task before going to the next task of a higher level. Video games use this model where one has to clear the lower level to go to the next level. Teachers need to give instructions, very very clearly and structured instructions, which deals with phonetics and structure of words. Instructions should be intensive, meaning short and clear. They need to be repeated so that the students can grasp them easily. Teachers should also give immediate feedback to students with dyslexia. If they make a mistake in reading, however minor it may be, it needs to be corrected immediately. There are many assistive devices which can be used to help such students. Ishan finds it easy to understand concepts if shown videos rather than reading about them. He uses word processors that help him with spellings and audiobooks to understand and learn. The teacher gives him modified assignments, where unlike his classmates, Ishan can present his work orally or even in the form of graphic organizers or even mind maps. His teacher modifies his tests, so they are asked questions orally and also he is given some extra time to complete his tests. Remedial teaching is a very effective teaching strategy which focuses on identifying specific learning difficulties and giving additional time and instructions to overcome them. Ishan's teachers also use the buddy system. The teacher has assigned a reading buddy for Ishan who has become his best friend in the class. You can check out my videos on remedial teaching and buddy system to understand these strategies in detail. As Ishan's teachers use all these teaching strategies, he has been able to adjust to the learning environment and also make friends with his schoolmates. So the role of the teacher in making students like Ishan develop a feeling of inclusion is of utmost importance. So this was about dyslexia. You can check out these references for detailed information on dyslexia. There are some very useful classroom activities to cater for such students in these references. You will find the links to these websites in the description box given under the video. If you know any other teaching techniques or tips, please feel free to share them in the comments section. Also, you could watch my other videos on inclusive teaching strategies. The links are shown on the screen and details are also given in the description box. Hope you liked this video and meeting Ishan. If you did, please like, share it and consider subscribing to my channel. So until next time, bye bye from Ishan and me. Thank you.